So if there's more than two bullets in the Kennedy party, then the explanation of only Oswald shooting becomes problematical. That's why this particular piece of the evidence is of interest at all. The uh, bullet components of the uh, JFK assassination study were seriously messed up because it was not understood that um, the investigation should have been multidisciplinary and not just chemical. What they measured in the bullets initially were antimony, copper, arsenic, and silver. If done well, they, these can be measured reasonably accurately. The underlying intuitive belief was that if bullets had the same composition, so a crime scene bullet and a bullet in a suspect's possession had the same composition, then they basically had the same source. Source should be, say, the pot of lead, but the way the FBI would use it is they would testify that they came from the same box. So that's the intuitive belief behind what the procedure is. And because it was chemical, just chemical, uh, key elements of the analysis statistics and metallurgy were not used, and that caused uh, people to jump con to conclusions that in hindsight there was no reason or uh, evidence that they should have jumped to. So if you had the beginning, middle, and end of a production lot, the assumption would be if you took a sample of lead from the beginning of the production process, the middle of the production process and the end, they would stay the same, and then yellow would be a different pot than blue, and green would be different than yellow, etc. So those were the assumptions, not checked, but they were the assumptions. In actual fact, these are actually measured from actual bullet production. This is antimony. So qualitatively, this picture is what the FBI was assuming, this picture is what actually you get. And uh, they took these beliefs that every batch of lead was the same and that different batches were almost surely different as a religious belief, but they could have checked them, but they never did. And when they were checked, they turned out to be false. I'm not saying there was another shooter. I'm not saying there wasn't another shooter. I'm saying that this testimony that he claims he knows the number of bullets from the chemistry is fundamentally flawed and that is being kind. But then the FBI didn't use any statisticians. So uh, it's another example of um, not appreciating that there's another field of science that could have helped them out.